Do you know what World Space Week is? Are you an engineer who's interested in outer space and our future as humankind and how you can get more involved, how you can make it to Mars, how you can have a career in aerospace, aeronautical, robotics, and involved with the aerospace industry? Well, then this video is for you coming up. Hey, 1% Nation, I'm Jake Voorhees, and you are watching the 1% Engineer Show, where we empower young engineers to rise to the top 1% of their career. And in this video, guys, I'm gonna be giving you an update about World Space Week, something that's going on right now, and I just did a video about this for the Mars Generation. The Mars Generation is another organization that I'm involved with, along with TEDx and Discovery and a whole bunch of other stuff beyond this brand, this community that you guys are a part of. So thank you for watching this video. That's why I have this frame right here. That's why I did a live stream with Aaron Shepard, Space Cadet Shep about how you can get involved with the Mars Generation. I would invite all of you to be a part of this community as well with us. I wanna let you guys know what World Space Week is. It's going on right now. It's an event that happens every year for the last 18 years between October 4th and October 10th. Those dates are significant for space because October 4th, 1957 was when we launched the first satellite ever into outer space. That was Sputnik 1. And October 10th signifies the Outer Space Treaty that happened 10 years after that, 1967, which basically laid some legal infrastructure for outer space. We can't militaristically colonize the moon or other planets or put nuclear warheads on satellites and things like this. So that's the reason why October 4th to October 10th is the week of World Space Week. And basically what goes on is dozens and dozens of countries, I think there's almost 90 that participate in this. And there's 2,200 events held all throughout the year this year where people are meeting up and talking about inspiration and excitement about our future in space and having careers in space and how you can get involved with things like the Mars Generation and other communities, other organizations who are helping you guys to be a part of this community, meeting other aspiring astronauts, meeting real astronauts, getting volunteer experience and all types of things like this. So I think there's a lot of 1% engineers out there who are pushing for aerospace career and can really benefit from being a part of this community as well. John Lupu, who has worked at Tesla and, and aspires to work at SpaceX. Jessica Drusco, who is studying to get her master's. She has a mechanical and aerospace combustion engineering master's. Now we have Paul Huber, who is computer and aerospace. These are some examples of people who are in my tribe who can get involved with these things. And you guys, 1% Nation, if you are a young engineer today, it doesn't matter what type of engineer you want to be. If you want to be electrical, computer, software, even civil, certainly mechanical, all of these people can have potential careers in the space genre leading forward because we're going to Mars, guys. We're gonna be out in space. We're gonna be among the stars. And I just know it. The way that technology is going, we're not gonna be able to believe, we're not gonna be able to fathom anything that is gonna be happening leading forward. So this video really serves for twofold. Firstly, of course, to give you information about World Space Week, but also to encourage you to get involved in these groups, in these communities. You will meet awesome people that you can be friends with forever, very ambitious, aspiring astronauts. And again, you can meet real astronauts and people who are working at space organizations and volunteering in all of these groups and communities and brands and other companies that are involved with space-like initiatives. And you just never know who you're gonna meet at these events. And the people who are going, the people who are participating, the people who are volunteering, these are 1% engineers who will certainly rise to the top 1% of their industry. And you want to be there with them. You want to be participating as well and putting yourself on their radar, volunteering, getting some more experience on that resume, meeting people, passing out business cards, doing whatever you need to be doing to advance yourself a little bit at a time to rise to the top and crush it in your field, become a 1% engineer, and have a great career, guys. So I'll show you this quick little video, 90 second video that I did about World Space Week. This is for the Mars Generation Student Space Ambassadors, for which myself and Aaron Shepard are board members. There's about 600 Student Space Ambassadors, and there's only 10 board members. So we have the ability to impact all of these young space ambassadors and help 
them to become astronauts, to help them learn, inspire, encourage them along so that they can literally rise to the 0.001% of their industry, which is to become an astronaut. So I am so, so honored and so thankful to be on the board and to be able to put out content for the Mars generation, for the student space ambassadors. And I'd love to share that with you, 1% Nation. So you guys know about my involvement there. It's no surprise. So check out this video. Hope you enjoy and get involved with World Space Week. They have virtual tours. They have all types of remote live events going on. So even if something is not in your city, then you can get involved. You can participate. It is worldspaceweek.org. So go check that out. Check out the 90 Second Mars Generation video after this, and I'll see you guys later at another video. Thanks for watching the 1% Engineer Show, guys, and stay hungry on your quest to become a 1% engineer. Cheers! Hey, Student Space Ambassadors, I'm Jake Voorhees, and between now and when we leave for Mars, we're going to be bringing you videos on space news, the Mars Generation updates, and resources so that you can be the best possible aspiring astronaut. And in this video, we're talking all about the World Space Week. World Space Week is a celebration surrounding science and technology and their contribution towards the betterment of mankind, particularly in regards to space initiatives. Declared by the United Nations 18 years ago, World Space Week is now the largest public space event around the world, which is exactly why you, as student space ambassadors, should be involved. This week commemorates two iconic moments in space history, starting with October 4th, 1957, when we release Sputnik 1 into outer space, the first satellite ever, and October 10th, 1967, when the Outer Space Treaty was finalized. There's nearly 2,200 registered events all around the world, and it's not too late to be a part of these. So head over to worldspaceweek.org and check out if there's any events near you, and if there's not, there's plenty of virtual meetups and tours that you can participate in. So get involved guys, you won't regret it. Thanks for watching this video, Student Space Ambassadors, and have a great World Space Week. Bye bye!